A call tonight for nurses to be respected. President Halima Yaqub says they are the strong backbone of Singapore's healthcare system and should not be subjected to any form of abuse. This was her message at this year's virtual ceremony for the President's Award for Nurses. And it comes amid cases of nurses being harassed and abused by some hospital visitors. There is absolutely no reason for anyone to vent their frustrations on our healthcare workers who are merely doing their job to ensure everyone's safety. So I call upon everyone to respect and support our nurses and other healthcare workers who, despite facing a greater risk of exposure to the virus, continue stoically with their work to serve others. Seven nurses were honoured with this year's President's Award for Nurses, the highest accolade in the profession. Shalin Sia speaks to two of them. When COVID-19 first struck, Sengkang General Hospital was the first in Singapore to implement a real-time location system for staff, patients and equipment. And its chief nurse, Christina Lim, was instrumental behind this operation. When, for example, we have a covid positive patient, we will actually be able to track who has been near the patient for how long and then we can actually do our contact tracing quicker and we are able to isolate patients quicker. And it, overall for infection control is a great uh, boon for all of us. Ms Lim has been a nurse for three decades and was pivotal to the setting up of SKH. She spent years laying the foundations even before the hospital opened. This other award recipient also lent her hand to Singapore's pandemic response. Dr. Shafali Shari is the first university academic to win the award. She had volunteered to teach more than 20,000 new parents how to take care of their children via weekly online sessions and currently runs a training program for nurses administering COVID-19 vaccines. Nurses from the various vaccination centres, they come to us and we educate them all the do's and don'ts around COVID vaccine. The aim is to standardise the practice. Now, a lot of experiences come in from the vaccination centres. We guide them accordingly so that everybody learn from each other. Beyond that, Dr Shari champions research in parenting and children's health. 